Hey, you guys, stick around to see how I did this dental floss hack. Hey, you guys, it's Steffi. So, uh, first of all, excuse me if I sound like all stuffed up because I am. I woke up this morning, I was sneezing, you know, those really deep sneezes. And uh, I don't know if it was from sleeping with my BiPAP last night or if I'm just getting a cold. I'm not sure what's going on. But anyway, here I am. Um, I saw this really cool dental floss hack on Instagram. And the girl's name is Miss Makeup Girl, and it's G-U-R-L. So if you get a minute, check her out. She's awesome. And I got this from her, so I don't want anybody saying I didn't give credit or whatever. So what you do is you take your gel eyeliner. You put it on a brush, like so. And then you have this, like this floss pick, and you put it like halfway down. Oh, I can't see, so I have to do this off. Okay, here we go. Halfway down, I'm going to do it on the side because I'm going to lay it down on the side. I'm just going to put it on everywhere. Okay. Wait, am I put, I'm putting on this side. Let me put it on this side. I'm putting it. Let me get some more. Putting it on the side that you're going to press onto your face. And I think I got some on the edge, so that's going to be a problem for me. Let me try to clean that off. I don't know if that's going to be a problem. Okay, and then you take it, and then you know how you know how I suck at doing wings, so this is like a wing hack. So you put it. Down. Oh, you can't barely see it. Okay, hold on. Maybe rub it in there a little bit. So you see that line right there? And then you take some more and you put it a little farther up, which for me, since I put it up too far anyway, I'm going to put it up the whole length of the, the floss. This is, am I laying it down? Yeah, I'm laying it down this way. Okay. And try not to get it on this part because I don't know if that will show up. Probably. And then you just take it and you like line the lines up to where it would make a wing. Like that. Oh, that's a lot. And then I'm just going to go and do the whole wing. Um instead of coloring it in in between let me see how i'm going to do this one am i going to go this way i might go that way okay and then you just keep following it through all right so now I'm going to color it in. You see how that made a cool wing? Now I'm just going to color it in with the with my little pencil here. Hopefully I don't screw it up. That looks pretty good, you guys. It's a little high right here. I'm going to have to rub that off a little bit. Oh, shit. Look what I did. better 
And then instead of trying to color it out, out here, I'm just going to move, take my finger and then pull it into a sharp wing. That looks pretty good. And then I'm going to go try to do it thinly on this part here. And I'm never good at this, but the, well, actually I'm using half lashes today, so I can't screw this up. And then I'm going to go, I'm going to go out a little bit here. Trying to make a sharp point. Yes, that looks good. And you know what's cool is that I'm I have hooded eyes and like it doesn't the wing won't go on my hooded eyes. I know I should stop now before I screw it up, huh? Okay. So I'm going to go do my other eye just like I, I did this one. And hopefully it comes out the same. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, the left side didn't come out as good as the uh, right side did. But it's I still made it work. So I'm wondering, do I need some more? Do I need some more right here? No. Yeah. No. No. Okay, so I'm just going to go in with the... Uh, mascara and I bought a new mascara I'll show it to you in a second this is um elf elf I don't know elf something and I'm gonna go in with falsies so it doesn't really matter what kind of I what kind of mascara you use and I bought some mascara just for my bottom lashes it's made just for the bottom lashes because if I use regular mascara on the bottom lashes, like it gets everywhere. It gets all over the place. So hopefully this will work or I just got conned. See, it's a little tiny thing. So let's see how I do. Oh, it works pretty good takes a little while but it works pretty good though yeah it does take a while let's see that worked all right Better than when I use regular mascara. I probably won't use it that much, honestly. I'll probably just stay with fake bottom lashes. Sorry about all the sniffing, like I said. I know it's got to be annoying. It's annoying for me. It's probably annoying for you guys. All right, so now I'm going to go in with some half lashes. I've never worn these before. Let's see if I can even find them. Where did they go? Where did they go? All right, I'll be right back. i got to find my lashes. Okay, I found them. They were in the wrong drawer. So you guys, I put on blush today. I don't know if I like it or not. I mean, I like the color. I just don't know if blush is for me because usually I just wear contour and highlight with no blush. 
So let me let me know what you guys think because I'm not I'm I just don't know. I just think it kind of takes away from the contour and I just really love contour and highlight. So I don't know. Let me let me know. So I'm going in with a half lash. I don't know if I'll stick with this. I'm just not used to it, so. Mm. No. Oh, you guys know me. You know I like my big lashes. I'm not doing this half lash shit. Okay. So I'm going to go in with my regular lashes, which are one of these pairs. Let me figure this out. Be right back. Sorry about that. Well, now that I'm going in with big lashes, I'm wondering if I should just go ahead and do bottom lashes. I don't know. I'll know when I'm done with the with the fake lashes. We'll see what happens. These are my new normal. You know, I was telling you before how I had a favorite pair, would never go without them. Well, I found ones that I like better. So the ones I was wearing forever and ever was it was called Lasha Lashes, but like when I was, when I would put them on, they weren't standing up the way I want. I found some of these that stand up, oh, they're just perfect. Just look how perfect these lashes are. I just love them so much. So, mm, I don't know about bottom lashes. Should I? Shouldn't I? I'm not going anywhere today, although I do host a meeting tonight on Zoom. So I want to look my best. I'll probably go with the bottom lashes. But then I wonder if it takes away from the inner inner corner. I wonder if it will take away from the eyeliner because I know that the eyelashes are already taken away from it a little bit. So I just don't know. Let me just see what I look like with just the top lashes on. And then I'll go from there, but I'm, I'm already kind of thinking I want to do bottom lashes. This is my trick, if you guys don't know, to make the blue get warmer and tacky faster. Do it with a blow dryer for a little bit. It works almost every time. I really like how this eyeliner turned out though. I just wish I knew how to do this without using dental floss. I know I say I'll keep practicing, but I mean, Jesus Christ, how many times, how many videos do I have to do and screw up the eyeliner every time? I don't know, maybe I was just using the wrong tools. Maybe then now that I'm using this really tiny brush, it will, I can do it better. Okay, so I can still see the inner crease. What's going on here? Like I don't see it in person, but when I look on the camera, it looks weird. All right, I can still see the eyeliner. So that's good. So I think I will go ahead with the, with the bottom lashes. So <clears throat> let me put all my shit away. Get my eyelashes out, and I'll be right back. Oh, I feel a sneeze coming on. Okay, so this is how I've been doing my bottom lashes. I've been taking these. These are actually top lashes. I just use them for bottom lashes. But I take one of these guys in the beginning and the end, and then in the middle, I put in some of these spiky guys one of these guys three of these guys actually so that's what i'm gonna do um let me go ahead and do my actually my right eye my left eye is getting easier let me go ahead and do my right eye off camera and then i'll come back and chat with you a little more okay so this is what they'll ideally look like but i need to put some black eyeliner in my water lines but i can't do that until the glue dries on these things so that's where we're at this actually the right side didn't take me that long 
Usually it takes me forever, so maybe the left side will take me forever. Something's always got to take me forever. Or maybe I'm just getting better at them. That could be it. So these lashes that I'm using right now are called Symer Eyelash Eyelash Eyelashes Pack. I can't read up close. Let me see this. Anyway, um, it's from Symer and it looks like this. Very, very cool to use for bottom lashes. They even, ha they even have um, single lashes down here. I've never used them, but I'm thinking about giving them a try sometime. But um, I love these for bottom lashes. They're spiky and awesome. The only problem is sometimes it sticks to the top. So I'll have a bottom lash sticking to the top. But, you know, it all works out in the end. So my husband just came in here and asked me, did I want to go to Dollar General with him? Because we need to get some more Pepsi. And I know, and I, and I always get candy when I go there. So I can't remember. I was thinking about this the other day, what kind of candy I wanted. And now I can't remember. Usually I get like milk duds because I love milk duds, but I was actually craving something else. And now I can't remember what it was. I either like milk duds or like um, peppermint patties, but it wasn't those two, and I can't remember what it was. Maybe I'll see it when I get there. This looks weird without black eyeliner in the waterline, but I'll fix that. So I put the long spiky one in this second space. That's my favorite one. The long spiky one's my favorite. It's weird on this side I can't use tweezers. On the on the right side, I use tweezers, but on this side I can't use them. Oh my god, look at my hand. Shit is everywhere. Black eyeliner, the jaw eyeliner just goes everywhere. And now here I'm making a liar out of myself. I'm using tweezers. Just because I didn't want to get that eyeliner all over everything. Oh, so what's new in my life? Um, not much. Ran up on my credit cards. Trying to pay them off just like the rest of America. But don't get me wrong. My bills are paid. Don't get me wrong. I'm not like that. What in the hell the... Did I blow off the, the glue? That was weird. I looked down and there was no glue on the thing and I know I put it on there. Not that dense. Actually, I think this is a short one. I think this is a short spiky one, so I'm gonna put this in this spot here. I'm gonna put another long spiky one in the other spot. Oh my God, you ever, you guys ever have like this endless need to sneeze? Like the sneeze is like way up in your nose and you can't, it like never comes out. And when it does, it's like all this stuff comes flying out of your mouth and it's gross. Yeah, that's kind of day I'm having.
Yeah, now I'm now I'm using tweezers over here and I just made a liar out of myself. Mm, it's coming along pretty good. Now I just need one more of the other the other kind. I don't know what it's called, but it's the one I put on the very beginning. I don't want to put spiky ones the whole way because I don't want to like scare people. I wonder if I should put some rhinestones on. I don't know. This video can't be that long. I gotta go to the store. Plus I have to have this video up by five. I find that when I put shorts up at five and I do shorts to promote my videos, when I put them up at five, I get a good amount of views. So I'm gonna let this dry. I'm gonna put on my lipstick. And then if I remember, hopefully I will go back. Actually, I'll put that eyeliner right here so I don't forget. Put it right there in front of my face. I'm gonna get some micellar water and clean off my hands because I have eyeliner everywhere. What color I what color lipstick should I go for today? I'm thinking like a light with some gloss, but um, I ran out of my light lipstick, so I'll just have to look through what I have and see. I won't bore you guys with this. I'll come back. I'll look for a lipstick. I'll figure it out and then come back. Okay, so I bought this light nude, kind of a light pink. This is very new, so I've never tried it before. So let's go. Kind of really like it with this lip liner. The only problem is it's not, I don't think it's a matte, so I don't know if I can put gloss over it, but let me just see here. That looks good. I like that. Maybe I don't even need the lip gloss. Yeah, I'm going to leave it like that. This was my second option. The first option was like a like a light tan beige what you would think of when you think of nude but very light and they didn't have it so i had to go with this yeah i really like that mm-hmm this is my new favorite brown eye brown lip liner with light pink lipstick. Okay, so now I'm going to find my regular eyeliner thingy and put on eyeliner on my waterline. Sorry, I'm talking like a robot. I don't know what's going on with me. All right, here we go. The sneeze is still stuck in there. I 
Yeah, that looks much better. See the difference? See the... It looks much better with the dark. I like it. I like this look. I love that hack. Okay, I'm going to take my hair down. Fluff her out a little bit. All right, you guys. So this is the final look. I hope you like it. I hope you subscribe. I hope you share. I hope you comment. And um, you guys have a really great day. I'll see you next time.